Hey. I'm sorry, I'm so no, late. No, no, don't worry about it. Is the uh, party small enough? Thank you. Yeah, sure. I just, you know, don't wake the baby. Oh, no, no, she's, she's sound asleep. So. Hi. Hi. You close the deal? <sighs> it's DOA. You sound defeated. No, it's just a mess right now. Never seen you give in before. I'm not. Fred's associate wants a prime. Well, that's a first. Maybe I'll let him play it out. You know, set a trap <laughs> tomorrow. Nice business you're in. Business is not nice. All cut up, plus a little extra. Say thank you. Gracias. April has a cold and a little fever. How high? 100. Oh, I think maybe I should call the doctor. I wouldn't. Um, how's your sister? She's improving, I think. She's, uh, she's not comfortable being a mother. She's been struggling. I would hate for April to have an accident. I really love that child. Is this something you've seen before? Yes. I'll see you tomorrow morning. Yeah, see you tomorrow. Marta, I really appreciate your help. Guess who? I give up. Hey. Hi. Right. Drunky McDrunkerson. Drunker <laughs> Steve. <laughs> hey. Hi. Good morning. No, it's not. Mm, it is for you. <laughs> you have to wake up. What's going on? Talk to me. Just the usual suspects. <laughs> you know, Katie, my mom, April works. A little vulnerability. <laughs> all right. Yeah, well. It's nice. It's okay. It's all right, yeah. Oh, let's definitely take two. <laughs> it's my lucky number. <sighs> She's a cold. Fever. Go, go, go. No, go. It's, it's better if I don't. That doesn't make any sense. 
The blogs say that if I go in every time she cries, then she'll learn to cry to get me to come in. Isn't that what mothers have done for centuries? Yeah. <laughs> but that's not what they tell you to do now. Oh, so we know better now. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe not. Wow. This is all so sudden. I mean, you've never showed any interest in children before. Well, I've never really had an interest. Do you like April? She's my sister's child. No, you like her. No, I don't. You do? No, I don't. A lot. She's just so tiny. And alone. Well, well, well. These hormones are kicking in, huh? No, they're not. So what happens when your um, sister gets better, leaves the hospital? I don't know. Go to her. Go. <laughs> it's 101.5. No. I gave her Tylenol, but... Should I bring her in? Well... Yeah, she's sleeping okay. Yeah, every four to six hours. All right, but how high a fever before I should bring her in? Okay. Thank you so much. Katie, hi. Whoa, 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 whoa. What's wrong? She's afraid that she'll never want to leave if she stays much longer. So she wants to leave now. It's counterintuitive. She's very frightened. <sighs> Did you tell her that it's better for her, better for April, if she rests for a while before she comes back home? Of course. And I want you to tell her that as well, to reinforce the importance of her getting better. Me? Yes. <laughs> she doesn't. Yes, she's concerned that you'll take the baby away from her. I know that's not the case, but she's been expressing those feelings. And she has also said that she's afraid someone's trying to harm her. Is there anyone who might want to harm your sister? Not that I'm aware of. Uh, where's the father of her child? Paolo, in Europe, the last time I asked her. Did they have an amicable breakup? It wasn't a relationship, more of a tryst. He has no interest in the child. He claims she tricked him into getting her pregnant. He's never even seen April. Well, let's, let's go talk to her. You need to reinforce that it's in her best interest in April's that she rest up and recuperate. Oh, great, okay. I'll be right back. Hi, Katie. I'm with Dr. Anderson. At the hospital near your room. No. I left April at your apartment with Marta. You asked me to come over here and see you. She has a little sniffle. Temperature, yeah. 103. <sighs> Tylenol. I did wash my hands, I did use bottled water in the formula, and I did clean the house. If it doesn't go down, I will take her to see Dr. Pagano. <sighs> Katie, Marta doesn't hate you. Okay. I promise not to leave April alone with Marta if you promise to take your medications and talk with Dr. Anderson. Deal? Deal. Can I come see you now? Okay. I'll come back tomorrow and we can visit. Okay, hon.
She said she doesn't want to see either of us right now. She just wants to close her eyes and forget. Every day she should improve. Should. 